All right, here we are, guys. One number seven. And I'm going to be setting up for here. Um, I'm just going to use a uh, extra mile on this one. And probably a Titan ball. So let me switch to that. Getting this up here farther has its advantages. Another thing that can give you just a little bit of extra distance is you can go for a uh, hook shot. So you'll see that I'm not using any uh, top spin or anything. But if I was to go for a hook shot, um, I'm aiming off the right of my bullseye. I typically aim maybe right around here and I'm thinking about going, so here's five rings. I'm gonna go about eight. So you'll see just on the other edge of this tree right here. <clears throat> And what this does is it creates just a little bit of extra momentum so the ball carries. Um, you know, in between bounces one and two, it's going to give you just a little bit of extra length and an extra push down here. And all the extra length that you can get makes the drive just a little bit longer. As I mentioned, I play those off the right of my bullseye so I can move less rings. And then on top of that, I only moved eight rings. Also keep in mind that I was trying to kind of land left of center of the fairway. So I, w I wanted to make sure that I created enough angle that I didn't get too tight to this right edge. So I was trying to land kind of left of center there intentionally. But you'll see with this approach, you know, and especially with the extra that I did uh, for, the, for the distance here, I have a very, very good chance to make this one. Um, keep in mind that this fairway is kind of a little bit all over the place. You do want to avoid certain spots. You'll, you'll see that the guide might stretch up at kind of an angle, and you'll want to kind of avoid. There you can see max clubs up there. You know, avoid the glitchy spots is what I recommend. So here you can see the wind's just a little bit more angled. We'll be pulling down here and right about here. 3.7-ish rings. Try to keep off the backspin. Again, just try to avoid those glitchy spots on the fairway. It's going to help it come in a little bit more true and stay online. But you can see very straightforward, another albatross chance. Um, you're going to be able to get, you know, all of these holes rather easily. Um, the, the secret is just kind of, you know, getting your perfect ball and concentrating on that timing. And you'll be able to really put up a good number on this score. So... Good luck there, and I will catch you guys on hole 8 momentarily.